Did you know that you could use your powers to handle things yourself? Right, that's why I'm here. And why you're here too. All you do is threaten me until I do everything for you. Using my powers, duh! Come on, man, we're all friends here. Yeah! Are we? Friends don't kidnap friends, especially because of where they work. It's pretty convenient that the structure deck with the most hyped reprints is the same structure deck that keeps getting kicked down the road. Hmm. Are you saying that there's a conspiracy? There's always a conspiracy, Kevin. They've been shitting out product this entire time with no issues despite nobody actually playing. And I don't recall any other structure deck getting pushed back like this repeatedly. I just, I just don't recall. P people play our game. <laughs> Look, Konami's gonna do what they're gonna do. And, and you're gonna do what I tell you to do. You already screwed up once. And I paid for it. Dearly. Believe me. I never want to see a Karibo again. I don't want this structure deck delayed again. In case you haven't noticed, I really like Cyber Dragons, and so do the players. You do know that there are other decks besides Cyber Darks and Cyber Dragons. Wait, wait, wait. you know I actually don't care that much, right? Then why are you doing this? What, what is this, the third time I've been kidnapped from work? I need more job security. Because it's my job to dual tain and to troll Konami because I see what they're doing. There's a reason why I'm Yu-Gi-Oh! Jesus. Acting famous is just part of the act. I let others do all the ass kissing for me. Why would I do that? Like, why would I do that? I want to do what I want to do. If you did do some ass kissing, they might send you stuff for once or, I don't know, not delay the structure deck. I don't care that much. I care about keeping in touch with my younger self and to spread that joy and nostalgia to others. I would care to play more often and do more than just Yu-Gi-Oh! Jesus stuff, but um, since nobody plays in Oklahoma, <laughs> uh, I just don't really care. Look, it can't be that dry out. He means that I have to use a stupid app because players don't exist anymore. I exist to argue with him, and I'm agreeing right now. I'm in a lot of pain. <laughs> well, look, they tell me you're a pain in the ass, and you tell me that you don't care while still obviously caring. For the fans and the Yu-Gi-Oh players, I was and still am one of those goofballs and I love them. Yeah, they're sad, they're strange, they're different, but you know what? They're not that weird. Everybody plays pretend doing something. Have you even seen what people do? So what if we're playing a little card game, okay? That's who I do it for. For those sad, delusional little guys out there, all of us playing Yu-Gi-Oh, me being one of them, okay? That's who I do it for. You don't need to be good. You just need to be strong. I see. I'll also see what I can do. And by the way, I'm still working with them about the Electromite thing, but they really don't want Triff becoming that powerful. He's gonna get powerful no matter what. The dude plays all the time, so he's gonna get good. That's literally how practice works. <laughs> You're right. Well, at least I understand you a little bit better now. And I have to say that this is the most pleasant visit we've had. It's not over yet. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just kidding. He is. I'm sending you back now. Imperm reprint. Make it happen. And lightning storm? Like I already said in another video, it could just be imperm because Cyber Dragon's on the art for that card and it makes sense. I'm an understanding guy, okay? They play their games, I play mine. And theirs. I'll see what I can do. Thanks, Kevin. Y'all should just bang and get it over with already. Me and Kevin or me and Konami? Yes. Subscribe! <laughs>